Hi everyone, it's Vicki. Welcome to my channel and I have a wantable. This is the, what do they call it, the body comfy edit, you know, like jammies and underwear and stuff. Uh, I did not mean to get this one. I don't really plan on keeping anything, although I haven't looked at everything, so I won't make that determination just yet. But um, I thought I had stopped this for a bit, but nope. I have stuff. <laughs> so let's take a look at it before I decide to send it all back because I really think I'm pretty good on the stuff that they've been sending in these types of edits. So let's just start with the first thing that comes up and that is a pair of like teddy bear fleecy jogger lounger pants by the brand M-N-Y and let's see do I have something yes here we go and these say a uh, long jogger and Chablis size 2x for $64 these are Mark New York performance now I don't I know I don't want to keep these $64 pants they are pretty heavy you know if I was living in an environment where I was cold, like maybe I had a house that, uh, you know, lived in an RV or an old house that was, what do they call that, drafty, maybe, but living in Florida, I think I'm going to send this back. It's very soft, it could be very um, enticing, because <laughs> it's so soft, but I don't need it, so I'm going to send it back. And th there's also a top that goes. And it seems to be just sort of a square cut, a bit, bit of a wide hem, just a plain arm. Um, yeah, I think it is a long arm. Same thing, it is furry knit pullover in Chablis 2X, $64, Mark New York. So together, these are, you know, $64 each. So it's a, it's a little spendy set. But, you know, for Christmas or something, that would have been nice to get for yourself or, you know, or to get as a gift. But yeah, those are going to be for sure. Just not very Florida. The next thing is a color that I don't care for. If you watch my channel anytime at all, you know I'm not a burgundy wine. I don't even know what it is. Is it a top? What the heck is it? Well, you can see the color. Looks a little more red and a little less purple when I hold it up to the viewfinder. But usually when I play it back, the colors are pretty accurate. What is this? Oh, okay. It is a brushed French terry cuddle wrap in burgundy for $42. It's very soft. It's like, um, I don't know, it's like softer than a t-shirt or as soft but thicker. Oh, okay. I got a double thing of it too, but it's still thicker, a little thicker than a t-shirt. Oh, wow. It's huge. I'm just now realizing how big this thing is. Um, you know, if I was living somewhere and going to football games, like in the fall, this might be nice, but like almost a blanket, <laughs> I guess, a wrap. It's very nice. I will say it's very nice. Probably worth $42. I just don't need it. And as far as like throws and wraps in my house, we are well covered there. <laughs> so that's going back in the bag to want to. All right, so they sent some slippers. Let's get these out to get a better look. They look small. What does it say? It says Suzanne slipper in violet size medium, $30 by Mucklux. Okay, well, the price seems right. They're very cute, although they're purple. They don't match anything. If they'd have sent me something that matched the robe I bought from them, I'd have probably been happier. But yeah, I'm not even going to put them on my feet. They look so small. They're size medium. It says medium, 7, 8. I wear an eight and a half. I will wear an eight in open toes, like flip flops sometimes, and in a real closed toe shoe, like a dress shoe, sometimes a nine. But for the most part, yeah, these just look small. I don't, but even if they did fit, I don't really want these. They don't really match any nightgown I have. I know, I mean, robes that I have. I know that sounds weird, but I don't know. I like my slippers to match my. I like them to be more neutral, I guess. And these are not. They're very cute. And if I was a purple person, I'd probably jump all over them, but they're going back as well. All right, so the next are, I don't know if they, yeah, these are things I can open and shut again. 
is a set. They have a note on here. This is a set. <laughs> so if you're going to keep one, you're keeping them both. All right, so they're just little sock feet things with um, rubber for walking around on them so you don't slide, I think. What do they call them? They call them the two-pack B Original BU Grip Socks in Port Black and Wine. So again, they kind of got these purpley mauve burgundy wine colors and they're $32 for the two pack so it's $16 a set that seems a little high to me but uh, yeah I'm gonna put these back to wantable as well yeah, I'm not gonna spend that much on these because I know you can get a lot better price on these maybe these are some higher quality in some way whoops excuse me just a minute I know they come free with your room in a hospital <laughs> Well, that's probably not true. I don't think anything's actually free in a hospital. Okay, so the next item looks to be a bralette. It says seamless triple cross bralette, 1x, 2x, $32. Okay, this might be a keeper. Uh, wow, it looks kind of small though. Yeah. No, it's not going to fit. It's not going to fit comfortably. <laughs> I can tell. Just by stretching it out, it's not going to fit comfortably. So I'm going to send that back as well. But I do like that. And if, if it wasn't a 1x, 2x, it could have been just a truly a 2x. I think it would have worked. But yeah, it looks to be too small to me. And so there's that. It's going back as well. This bag is so full. Oh, I think I just put my finger through the plastic on the wallet. And the last item is a pair of undies in 2X. And they are a plus size signature lace boy short in chai size 2X for $35 by Hanky Panky. I think these are similar to the ones that I got before. And they are writing up a bit. So I'm going to pass on these too. Uh, the closest was the bralette. Maybe the second, but this boyfriend one that they're just not staying down in the back. They're pulling up and I'm also to pull them down. <laughs> wow, this bag is completely and totally filled with everything going back. So I do appreciate you watching the video, even though it's kind of a disappointing. Um, I have now, I'm positive my edit has stopped for the, what do they call this one again? sleep and body edit yeah i don't i think getting a sleep and body edit for me every month is a little too much i think you know maybe a couple times in the fall and maybe once in midwinter or something i don't know but uh yeah i don't or maybe i'd be better off with the summer ones where they had you know lighter robes and stuff i don't know if i'm gonna be able to close this bag honestly it is that cool i've taken the so I'm committed to now turning this over and making this stick, but I can't get the product out of the way. <laughs> but anyway, what I was saying is I just think that I don't need a body edit, a sleep and body edit once a month. Um, yeah. So all things back, I do appreciate you watching my videos. I hope that you will like and subscribe to the channel. And um, Happy New Year. Yeah, today is... January 1st or 31st listen to me today is Friday is what that says I have a hard time reading it uh, December 31st and it's 82 degrees here so you can kind of understand why this whole fuzzy thing and shawl thing did not appeal to me I hope your new year is great I hope you're healthy and prosperous and happy